Hello everybody and welcome back to Global Swim Beyond Home World. Today we are heading only up and holy shit we're finally going interstellar but not today because today we are gonna assemble the craft that's gonna get us all the way to interstellar orbit to Kerbal. We're gonna visit back home, back our own solar system. But while we're launching, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell so that you don't miss any new video launch, which is happening every Tuesday. So, damn, big rocket. I did build it, build this in purpose. It's kind of overpowered, to be honest, but it's fucking massive. Also, it's the most powerful rocket that I've ever built, without any clipping or cheats. I've done that in the past. But that rocket never got to launch because 4, 000, 400 parts was a bit too much for my little laptop to handle. Or this PC to handle. Or any other PC that is not an SS computer. Yeah, that game. This game doesn't really like high part counts, does it? But yeah, this is the most powerful rocket that I've ever done. The I've never built and launched. By the way, the most powerful rocket that I've ever built was built in version 1. Point, probably 2. Which some might argue was the most balanced version of the game. I'm here to argue that 1.4 was kinda better. 1.11 was good, but 1.12 had some of that some things, but now this is 1.2. 12.2? Yes, it should be, but yeah, whatever. On to the second launch of the day, which is gonna be the crew. This is finally, I'm bringing Jabari, Bill, Bob, also Valentina, and some other crewables up into interstellar mission. They have the most important mission in the world. So, yeah. We're gonna go there. Again, I'm hyping this up, but we're not gonna go there in this mission. Because this, again, this is only a six minute long video, which is me constructing the transfer stage. Which also has two planes, which need to fly. Where are we going? I'm not gonna spoil that yet. I'm just gonna spoil that we're going interstellar. Yeah. Again, the same rocket. We're launching it and booster separation. How many boosters? I don't know. And yeah, the core stage should have like eight, nine, something vector state engines. And the outer engines have to be either the main sail or the key ones. And I have an itchy fucking chin. I, I forgot for a second what this thing was called. It's a chin. Yeah, here we go. Cutting all the boring part of trying to rendezvous. Rendezvous. Rendezvous, rendezvous, rendezvous. I have a feeling that this that word is French. And French is a weird language. I don't know how it's still a fucking language, to be honest. Yeah. Wibbly wobbly. As it usually does. And I hate it. It brings me so much pain. Here are the third and fourth launch of the day, which are the space planes. Again, I did the launch the same and then separate both thing, which looks cool. I like it. I like how my editing skills just keep on upgrading while I do this cringe nonsense. I'm just here yelling at my mic and talking shit out of my ass. Good. Well, people seem to enjoy it, some people. Some people just say that I'm swearing too, I swear too much. 
but I'll try to stop that because I don't like it myself either. Mm, but whatever. Yeah, this is the space plane. It was held by two arms and a lot of fucking struts because yeah, not stable. Wait, no, this is Kerbal Space from 1.12.1, which was still real bad. Yeah, still real bad at physics and stuff like that, yeah. So, as you see, the transfer stage is a massive uh, nuclear stage. It is powerful, also it is really efficient. But it has some flaws, which you're gonna see in the next episode, which is gonna be next week, hopefully. So stay hyped for that. This video is still not over, by the way. Stay hyped for this mission. Whoever not hyped for this mission, get hyped. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. But yeah, we're docking one of the planes, and the other should be docked soon. Yeah, there we go, one, of, one is docked, and the other is also docked, and that's the end of the video, I hope you enjoyed, if you did, post love from the post if you are new, and as always, I hope to see you next week, until then, have an awesome week!